Okay, a test here now for, for max speed. Uh, here, if I swipe to the right, uh, then uh, here this 20 amp relay by, uh, is activating the thing. If I swipe to the left, uh, then uh, it is bypassing it. So right now uh, it's just the ordinary uh, and here I can go to up to 50 volt. Uh, yeah, so, so. It's going a bit uphill. So this is uh, 11 to 12 kil kilometer uphill. And, and now I will switch to uh, Now we are uh, at 32 volt. Yeah, it's for 200 meters a bit flat. Then I will go to max speed. Uh, current. Because the 20 amps are really quickly achieved. Okay. Eighteen kilometer per hour. And so So now I'm And there was a bit of smell. Uh, I, I, I need to install a, a cooling fans below. Let's see if it's really hot. Uh, not, not really. So I, then I did turn off here. Uh, let's see if it's still working. Yeah, it's still working. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah. Ah. 18 kilometers per hour, and it was going slightly uphill uh, on the first run. And when I opposite direction was going slightly down, I, I made it 20 kilometers per hour. And this is really uh, this this peeping is because there is some uh, the, the motors here. If I turn off the motors, then this beeping stops because I have some um, uh, interfering with uh, interfering with uh, uh, communication, and therefore it constantly uh, 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 detects a uh, blinker left, a blinker right, and that's. But I'm uh, here. This is also the ESP here. Thirty-two is, is going to be uh, replace the old Arduino Mini here for the, the complete control of the car will also go inside. And, and in, in the beginning, it, it was only five kilometers per hour and pulling me. So first 2000 kilometers, I was pulling this thing because it was just a home. And that was the most important and winter was coming. And, and there, so I, I decided on do not uh, add the motor. We didn't have the time. So I simply pulled it. The, the first 2000 kilometers uh, and then uh, different generations of motors it was then six kilometers per hour because then it's legally not a, a powered vehicle a craft fahrzeug 
in Germany. Uh, but then uh, I added here this uh, la last winter of previous uh, added here this pedal crank, and then it was legally a pedal leg, an e e-bike. E it could go up to 25 uh, kilometers per hour uh, here in Germany, and so I, I could uh, uh, remove the six kilometer per hour limit, and that was 10 kilometers. Then I made this field weakening uh, from the e Ferru. Uh, firmware and then I reached 12 kilometers per hour. That was what you was seeing when I did not use the booster. And this was already uh, in the last uh, months or year, uh, 12 kilometers. That's not, uh, it's more than a home. It, it's, it's, it's already uh, became a, a transportation uh, vehicle. So I could really uh, say, okay, I want to go there and transport something to there and and so now was uh, in the in the flat uh, 18, 18 to 12, 20 kilometers. This is really uh, the max speed of such a uh, four wheel because if you go faster, then it will tip over. And and so um, yeah, I have to um, make uh, some some more uh, adjustments here to to, to the uh, uh, mechanics so that it really is, is uh, ready for 20 kilometers per hour, but. Uh, yeah, it, it works. <sighs> ah, boosting uh, hoverboard from 20, 24 volt to 50 volt. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Bye bye.